Now, this is probably the best weekend of the year when it comes to sneakers. We've got Yeezys, we've got some Cause collaborations with Jordan Brand, we got some Vapor Max, we got some Adidas Boost. It's just a big, big weekend. Let's start the show. <laughs> What up folks, Jacques Slade here, and to celebrate Thanksgiving, the brands are going all out with some heat that you're definitely going to appreciate. Let's start with what actually dropped today. First up, we have the Air Jordan 32 that was created for Russell Westbrook and OKC. There is no official name on these, though many people are just calling it Russ. Those will cost you 185 and they're available over at Finish Line. For you phone posit fans out there, Nike didn't forget about you, and they have a Legion green pair that dropped today, and those will cost you $230. Jumping over to Adidas, we have the Crazy 8 ADV Prime Knit dropping in three different colors. There's a black pair, there's a sesame pair, and a night cargo pair. All three of those will cost you $150 for that Kobe-inspired love, and those are available at Finish Line as well. If you're looking for something a little more casual, Nike has the Air Hirachi dropping in the NYC and the Shy colorways. For those that don't get the reference, basically they're dropping them in a black and in an orange colorway, but they flip the shoe a little bit with the zipper instead of laces. Those will cost you $130. As far as I know, all brands are taking off Thanksgiving, so you don't have to worry about waking up early to cop a release, but things do start to heat up early on Black Friday. First up, Finish Line is going to have the core black pair of the Adidas EQT Support 9317. This is the upgraded model with the boost for the midsole, which makes them extra comfy. Those are gonna cost you $180. Now, if you're looking for something from Adidas in the EQT line, but don't want boost in it, then they have the EQT Support ADV. That'll be dropping in black as well. Those will cost you $110. Coming from the good folks over at Jordan, brand we have the Air Jordan 11 Aris. Now these have a bit of glitter and sparkle to that patent leather rand that you usually see and those will cost you 220. I'm actually kind of feeling these. If you're looking for a special forces Air Force One, Nike linked with Odell Beckham Jr. for a special wheat or tan color pair that they're dropping on Black Friday and those will cost you 160. One release that kind of slipped up on us is the Nike SB Dunk Elite Bear Brick. Now these celebrate the 15 year collaboration between the two brands and those will cost you 115. With Black Friday happening, Nike Sportswear is playing up the theme with an Air Max 95 and an Air Max 97. Both models are considered premium and come in a black and a gold colorway. The Air Max 95 will cost you 180, while the 97 will cost you 160. Speaking of black, the Nike LeBron 15 is dressing its bat on an upper in black and pairing it with a gum outsole. Just beautiful. These are scheduled to release on Black Friday and will cost you $185. Okay, now let's switch to Saturday. Nike Sportswear is bringing something a little different with the Air Max 90 and the Air Max 95. The design team created a couple of different colorways that have these big graphics on the mid panel of the shoe, and they come in a few different colorways. You can grab the Air Max 90 in black or crimson for $150, while the 95 that's going to come in obsidian and it'll cost you $180. And you can actually grab both of those over at Finish Line. Okay, earlier this year, Nike Sportswear brought us the Air Max 97 in the original silver or silver bullet colorway. It looks like these are actually returning a bit of a restock happening for men and women over at Finish Line, and they're gonna have them available for you on Saturday, and you can grab those for 160. Uh, for you Jordan fans out there that like the Timberland inspired look, the Air Jordan 1 Wheat is dropping on Saturday as well. Those will cost you $160. Uh, there is no question that Steph Curry is one of the biggest stars in the league, and Under Armour is giving us a chance to grab the Curry 4 in the More Rings colorway. Now these actually originally dropped as part of the championship pack, but you can grab the white and gold pair, which I think was the best in my opinion, starting on Saturday for 130. Also dropping on Saturday is the Nike Dornbecker collection. Well, at least part of the collection. Some of it released last week, but the Jordan 12, the Hirachi, and the Genoski are actually gonna drop this week. Boost, Yeezy Boost. I know you want to know about the Yeezy Boost. Uh, if you did enter the raffle in store, uh, you still have a chance to cop this Saturday. Finish Line is actually holding an opportunity for you to grab pairs inside the Finish Line app. If you're not already a Finish Line Circle member, now would be a good time to join to make sure you don't have any issues when the shoes actually drop in the app on Saturday. Now, this is obviously a very special weekend when it comes to releases, so there are a few things dropping on Monday, AKA Cyber Monday. Uh, first up is the Nike Air Vapor Max Flyknit. Now this is the regular version of the Vapor Max Flyknit and you can grab that regular version for $190 for both men and women. There is also the Nike Uptempo that's dropping on Monday over at Finish Line. This is the Volcanic colorway and it looks kind of like a navy Maybe or a dark blue, or maybe it's a, a lightish black or bluish black. I don't know. Uh, those are 160. And if you like the Vapor Max, but you don't like to tie your own shoelaces, the Vapor Max mock is dropping for both men and women. There are a few different colorways of this shoe dropping. I personally really like that multicolor pair, and those are available for both men and women for $200. Now, on the Reebok side of things, we have the DMX Run 
10 by Cameron. These are scheduled to release on Monday as well, but they will only be in store at specific locations. And last but not least, I'm gonna call this the rumor section of the show uh, because there are some Air Jordan calls are scheduled to be dropping on Monday. Those are said to be priced at 350, not confirmed. And then there's also the Air Jordan 1 Top 3 Gold. Now these originally made their debut at Complex Con earlier this year, but it looks like they will be making it to certain stores on Monday as well. Those will cost you 160 if you can find yourself a pair. Okay, again, for the Yeezy Boost Beluga 2.0, these are only dropping within the Finish Line app unless you signed up in store for a raffle. And if you signed up for a raffle, you should already know if you want a pair. Uh, like always, these are 220, and again, they will be very, very hard to cop. So good luck. You guys have a happy Thanksgiving. I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line. And as always, guys, I appreciate you. Happy shopping. Peace.